Hi guys, um, we're back with another Rivals. Me versus the main man, Danny Wrench. And, well, I've lost the last two of these, so I'm blooming eager. Blooming eager to try to do some damage in this one. We start with three minute games, and it's uh, best of three. And I'm going to try to take this one a little bit more sensible, a bit more seriously even than I have done in the past. Um, right. So, I'm forgetting my theory already. So, what do I do here? Castles, will he take here? Okay, let's try Let's try castling. And again, I'm going to go for my quick attacking chess here. Um, okay, so I've sacked a pawn, so I must play aggressively in this position. And what? how do we do that? Do we dive in? Let's dive straight in. Knight here with ideas of queen f3. And it's going to be, it's, I mean, I really need to win this first game. Like I said, he's he's taken me down two times now, has Danny. So I don't, it can't be a third time. It just can't be. It can't be. Okay, right. So um, how do I keep the pressure on his position? Well, I need to keep creating threats. Now, here, knight here. He's going to go bishop here. So I need to keep the pressure on. This check, bishop here, queen e2. What about that? Is that an idea? I have this check as well. Does that help me at all? Um, maybe I go for this check and take the pawn here. This might be a good idea because I need to stop bishop e7, stop him castling. This is my main idea. So he can't go bishop e7 because I take on f7. So I'm going for maximum attack here, taking a lot of risks, but maybe just d5. But then I check him and go queen takes c5. So um, we're going to go for this check. And if he blocks, I have queen takes c5. And now if he castles, I'm hoping I have rook takes e7. If I go queen takes e7, he has rook e8. So, wow, look at this. He's going for a big tactical idea there. I'm just going to go knight takes uh, with the idea bishop takes, knight takes there, check. Um, and, okay, the much more sensible move he's done. And now if I take here, I get back spanked. So he's 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 weathered the storm here, has has Danny. But at the end of the storm, I do seem to have an extra pawn. Now, one thing I know that I must avoid against Danny is any sort of time problems because he's so damn quick. I mean, he's just like Mr. Speedy gone Danny-ish. Um, he's unbelievably quick. So... Uh, that is one thing I'm trying to do, and also I'm just trying to avoid any cheap tactics. So I've got an extra pawn, half my time down. So let's just play natural, sensible moves here. Um, okay, now I'm happy to generally swap off most pieces because I've got this extra pawn. Can I take advantage of it? Well, let's save my back rank, and now I'm going to have to go into blitz mode. Okay, come on. So it's all about time. There's no increments, no increments, so... It's all about the speed of my moves. I'm trying to use this pin now. Bishop e3 is my main idea. I mean, no idea what was happening in the opening there. Very interesting opening we both had. And like I said, I've got this big pin. My idea is to go knight e2, increasing the pressure. So he's gone back here. Looks like we will now get an ending because the only way he's going to save his queen is by going into this ending. I'm a pawn up here. Um, is it going to be enough to win? Well, I need to move quickly, as we know. Speed is of the essence, but I want to get myself an outside pass pawn. Come on, guys. Go, pawns, go. Do, 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 do. And come on, Harry. Come on. Come on. You can succeed. Um, okay, right. Um, now, let's bring the king around. Um, now, if I mess this up, I'm going to be so annoyed with myself so annoyed so focus focus don't mess it up come on can i go there takes well let's just play simple as i can and try to win this one and i've got to note his pawns are blocked over there so let's now trap that knight there so it cannot move and it can i deal with his pawn if he goes here i i jolly well hope so um okay now I'm just going to give this one up to try to force my A pawn through. I'm hoping I can stop these pawns over here. Now, just got to avoid freaking out here. Um, and he has managed to save this one. 
Oh God, am I making this harder than I should be? Let's use Eddie. And now, come on Eddie. Come on, let's roll with the pawns. And this must be winning, must be winning. I mean, if I somehow mess this up, it will be, it will be castro... Okay, it will just be terrible. So I want to get this stressful first game out of the way. Okay, I need to take this pawn. It's got to be winning, just the time. And now only one pawn he's got left to try and do this. Is he somehow... If he takes, I've got knight d5 check. This is always my idea. And now this should just be easily winning. My king now walks in. It's going to walk, Danny. It's coming for you. It's coming for you, Danny, sir. It's coming. Oh, it's check. It's not coming. Oh, no. What am I doing? Don't do this. Is he not? He can't hustle me in this position. It is impossible for him to do this. Okay, come on. Time is running. No, queen. Anything. Anything. King comes in. King comes in. King. No, what's happening here? What on earth is this? How on earth is this possible? How on earth is this possible? What's going on? No! What have I done? How, how do I win this? How do I win this ridiculous position? This is crazy. At last! No! Oh, no! Oh, no! That was unbelievable. I completely freaked out there at the end. That was, that was just terrible, terrible, terrible. If I can't win a game like that, what is going on? Absolutely, absolutely disastrous. So, I mean, that was so easily winning. Okay. <laughs> Let's get back there. I mean, how did I not win that? I mean, I had so little time. That was my main issue here. Okay, so don't let it affect you. Don't let it affect you. How can I not beat Danny in that position? I'm a piece and a pawn up. I mean, I just can't handle the, the, the quickness of things. So, okay, come back, use the force, relax. Everything is okay. Now, I'm going to go for an aggressive um, sort of punchy opening here with moves like f5 and b5 so he stopped my b5 so i'm now gonna try uh do i go f5 here i don't know i don't know where does my knight go i i'm always worried about the mood d5 here is d5 strong here god oh he should have gone d5 there d5 is a terrifying terrifying move to deal with but i still don't like the way my opening has has Developed there. I mean, castling looks so scary. Okay, I'm so annoyed with that first game. <laughs> oh my words. Okay, right. So, come on. Let's let's not crack up now. I'm going to tuck my king here because it's going to need some protection, and I want to get my rook around to do as much protection as is possible. On the other hand, his queen is coming here. I have f5 then. So let's get the rook there so I can. At least try to defend it in some sense way. Now my knight here is in the way. So I want to move it maybe somewhere like d8. So my bishop can come to life here. And okay, we're not we're not worried about anything going on over there. I've got queen f5 coming in. Queen f4. And I want to increase the pressure over on this side. Harry is coming. Harry is coming. Come on, Harry. And... It's a pity about my knight. My my knight is, is is on a ridiculous, ridiculous square there. And I'm going to have to... Well, okay, I, I, I have to allow him to swap off this bishop to get my knight back around. Do I have any rook takes g2s coming in in certain positions? Is that ever going to be a possibility? He's thinking... Is he thinking a knight here now? And then knight takes pawn? That seems exceptionally greedy. To me, I mean, maybe he was just thinking queen here, but what's he doing against that move? That that is unbelievable on Danny's part. He he he's obviously before this. I saw he played a challenge match with John Bartholomew, and John 
did get the better of him. I think he's cracked him for me. Can I win a game? What does it feel like to beat Danny? Will I dance naked on the streets of London? Well, London's about an hour from here, so I, I jolly well hope I won't be dancing naked, and you probably don't want to see that either. Um, okay, um, so... Um, right, well this this is an awful move from Danny, he should have gone knight there, but then I had knight d6, a very comfortable position anyway, so things weren't totally tragic, but what what's Danny doing, is he is he crying? Oh Danny, do you want me to go and get you some tissues? Because <laughs> you're not bloody having any of mine, put that in your pipe and smoke it. No, I, I'm, I, what's he doing, he's just, he's had enough, he's had enough now, so he's saying, how can I make such a blunder, I love to hear him on his end of the video at this moment in time because he must be doing a lot of swearing at this moment so um okay okay and sorry just gonna uh quickly find out what's going here um because i'm supposed to be doing another show after this stop crying danny are you gonna play a move what are you doing danny where are you danny uh, da, 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 da. okay so well i'm gonna have a bit of my coffee here i'm gonna have some coffee What's he doing here? I've never seen Danny so so beaten down. So beaten down. Has he been he's really beaten down. Look at him. He's, he's oh he's gone back now after after shedding some tears of pain. Now come on. Come on, Simon. You're you've got so much extra time. You're up on the clock. You're up on the clock. You if you lose this, you are a absolute moron. You're not just a moron. You are moron mr moron of the moron world in moron land and you know what they say that is one big moron oh can we do something sexy can we do something sexy here can we do something sexy i'm getting carried away with some sexiness i'm gonna have to do something sexy because that is just just what i want to do i have to do it i have to do this i'm taking some risks here but i want to i want to finish in a little bit of style What's he doing? Is he trying to check me over here? Is he? Is he trying to check me over here? Now, don't get tricked. Don't get tricked. Don't get tricked. He's got one check. He's got one check. But you know what, Danny? I've got a check. I've got a big check. My check is bigger than yours, Danny. And just to prove that my check is bigger than yours, there it is. I have the big check. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, um... Okay, uh, I'm, I'm, we're gonna have to maybe. Okay, let's let's get it on. Let's get it on. And that was good. Just need half a point now. What are we gonna play? Well, let's go for a the same again because that was a, a lot of fun, wasn't it? That crazy, crazy line we just had. So maybe I will go. No, let's stick to this. Let's stick to this one. And okay, now we're gonna go for a G3. So Danny now going to Queen's Indian. He didn't like the chaos of the last game. And he needs to win this game to level the score in the three-minute portion. I've had this position a number of times. I've even filmed a DVD on this position. So I know it reasonably well. Knight, Knight E4 is supposed, supposed to be um, a premature move. So we're going to see now if that is true or false. Because his pawns could well be rather weak here. Um, I've got to watch out for moves like here, and I've got, I think I've got a better pawn structure. God, he's, he's angry, isn't he? I've never seen Danny so angry. <laughs> he's coming at me. He's coming at me. Okay, so are we going to let him come at me? You know what? I normally always have the fun, the attacking fun when I'm playing Danny, and now he's coming at me. Um, so, okay, I, I, gotta, I, I don't want to allow him to get any initiative here, so I'm going to try to block things up on this side of the board for a little bit of time. Whose king is going to be weaker? I don't know. Uh, and shall I sack this pawn somehow? Something like pawn here? Don't really want to play some sh passive defensive move. Knight here takes rook here. Let's sack the pawn. Let's sack the pawn. We, we don't we don't want the pawn um, anyway. Let's, let's just give him the pawn. Let's give him the pawn. Okay, so we go here. And he has won a pawn, but I'm hoping... I'm going to get good compensation because of his weak e6 pawn. And I've got these open files 
that I'm slashing along. So I'm getting messages because I'm supposed to be uh, starting a show very shortly. So I'm getting multiple messages at this moment in time as well, just to add a little bit of pressure. Um, okay, so we're going to go Rook E1. And hopefully that is a gone. I don't know if I should have gone Knight to B5 there. Knight to B5 might have been... Oh, he's really, he really wants to hold on to that pawn, doesn't he? For the love of his life. It's a, you know, okay, so how do we increase the pressure? Well, um, okay, F4 and take with a queen is possible, but I don't somehow believe it. Okay, should we put the rook here? So I can try to go knight here, but he's now I'm letting his. It's not looking like as much compensation as as I certainly would have wanted. And he's got his knight coming in here. Where 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 am I going here? I should have gone here last move, shouldn't I? Um, now I've just let his rook into a good square. Silly of me. Okay, we have to do this now and try to get my queen into the position. Craftily move this queen around. Queen takes here. And maybe try to get it into this square. Um, now, I won't be taking that back. Uh, but my king is looking very weak. I'm throwing this away. Um, now, I could go here and try to cause some mischief. But I've, I've given away a lot of squares. So, we're going to go for this and try to come round the sides for his king. But, of course, my king is lacking any any pieces as protection here so if he moves his king back what do we have there it's getting chaotic and i'm short of time i want my knight to float into d6 so we're going to try this one now i have to go for this move i have to keep my pieces coming forwards and danny's gone for an attack himself but this does allow this and i was hoping after my king goes here he doesn't have any good checks now i'm going to try to reroute get my rook around to a much more dangerous square he can block with his rook then i should be able to come around the back rook d1 rook d8 so if he goes okay so he's coming he's trying to defend this way instead i don't have queen g7 i'm gonna go for my rook get, trying to get into d7 if he blocks his rook like i said i can take it this is an excellent defensive piece my next move is rook d7 so his queen has to stay here to defend the g7 square and my rook is trying just to float its way into d7 uh can he defend this has he got any way to defend well i hope not i hope he hasn't got any way to defend um in this position um let's see his time is ticking down i'm getting messages because i've got a show another show in 10 minutes People are trying to say, where are you, Simon? You've got a show. You've got a show in 10 minutes. Where are you? you? You've got to be on Skype. Okay, so what happens if I move my rook in here? Is he going to go knight here? Is he Is he going to go knight here? Knight here. Okay, and I'm getting multiple messages. This is not helping me. Yermo, Yermo, you're Yermo in me. Do I take here? Let's take this one. And now if I've got a check, my king can come here. He's got another check. My king, can it escape the checks? So I have to take here. Well, I have to go for this. Time. Time again. I've just tried to... Got to if he goes pawn on, I take here. I'm trying to avoid... Oh, God, what's happening now? Can I go... Can I do this one? Can I do this one? Can I... Can I... I don't know if I'm escaping it. I'm down on time. So frustrating at the moment. I've got this mate threat. Um, got this mate threat. Um, I've got to try to get a draw here, I think. This check here is met by this one and luckily i have two threats he's got this move yes he's gone for it and he knows about my time my time handling so he's gone for a very quick finish um which is quite tragic because i feel like uh, i feel like i'm not gonna do this in time Unbelievable. Now, pre-move. I know why I'm going to pre-move this one, is there? Let's try some tricks. Only way I've got. Trying to do what they do in... What the chess bras do. Ah! Ah! 
God, that was annoying. And I've got to now answer this bloody message about doing some work. Okay, just bear with me, guys. Yeah, I'm hosting. I think should, I cannot upload them both. Okay, I'm getting lots of messages here. Great. I'm going to have to just answer these messages. And we're going to have to... Um, do, 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 do. Let me just see. I've got, I've got um, things going on everywhere. Great. Um, I'm, I'm just going to have to now tell Danny we might have to make this decider. Very, very sad that. Um, do, do, do. Might have to... Might have to make this uh, decider as okay. Let's do it. Decider, decider. This is the big one. Whew. Whew. So we're not going to be able to do our normal one minute and uh, the normal uh, rest of it because um, I basically got a show of doing live. We'll get another chance to do a rivals match, but this has been a great three minute match anyway. Um, and so we're going to, um, okay, just, just, I'm going to have to do one message to Yomo. Okay. Um, be with you soon. Just finishing a show. Okay. One more. Let's do it. So I'm going to turn off everything. Use the force. Use the force. Use the force. Okay, winner takes all. And is it going to be another French defence? Will he let me have a Dutch? Will he? Oh no, he's gone. For, he's gone for a, tre a cheeky little line of the French. So, oh, he's gone for a boring. Oh no, I hate it when they do this. He's gone for a positional boring game. You're not allowed to do that. You can't do some boring positional stuff on me. What's wrong with you, Danny? What's wrong with you? No, I'm not allowing it. Okay, so I'm going to go for a Dutch setup anyway. Um, Danny trying to just keep things under control. He's going to try to positionally outplay me. <laughs> None of that, please. None of this positional rubbish. I mean, who on earth tries to positionally outplay their opponents? What kind of fool? What kind of fool are you, Mr. Mr. Wrench? Going for this positional idea? I spit on your, on your, on your foolish idea. Okay, enough of that. So we've got a long manoeuvring game for a change. This is where he thinks he's going to get me. Now, I can occasionally play long manoeuvring games. Occasionally. Um, only only on a full moon. Um, let's hope that this is going to be one. Now, do I go for the night? Okay, I'm going to plonk this here. I, he, I'm sure he's going to swap this off. And we're going to get a weird position of bishops versus knights then. Um, now, he doesn't want to do that, so this is my main idea, to give me this move to force his pieces backwards. Um, and now he has to get, get this one uh, going going home. Now, do I actually allow the doubling of my pawns or not? No, because I don't think there's a need to do that. Um, I've got b5 coming, so he's, he's very wisely stopped, stopped me from doing that. Now, if takes, queen takes... Um, is my main idea. Do I have some crazy move like this? Do I have that move? Does that even help me? Um, takes bishop here with c9. Because I don't want to give him this square here. So as John Bartholomew me would do. Keep things simple Simon. There's no point over complicating things. It's a simple game. I don't think John speaks like that. But um, I'm just, just trying to get into his psyche. If I can. I, I, don't, I don't know. I don't think he speaks like Mr Bean. Not as far as I am aware. And what is Danny trying to do to me? Is he trying to put his bishop back there? Okay. Now, for my bishops to come to life. I've got to remember, this is a decider. Um, I need to get the move um, d5 in. Can I play it now? Um, I'm not going to rush. I'm not going to rush. I'm thinking I want to play d5. Let's tuck... Well, I have to. I have to now roll with d5. I, I have to, of course, play this move now to get my bishops in. I should have gone d3 as well, but we will now play it, trying to use some bishop power. And okay, my position should be jolly good here. Jolly good, old boy. Jolly good. And how do we? He's going to put this here. Okay, let's plonk the bishop here to make sure that is consolidated this could be a battle of time versus position my position is better i there's no 
doubt in my mind I've got a better position here but I can't let him get up on the clock now I've moved here some diagonalism going on there not even sure if that's a word oh my word you're so greedy Danny you're so greedy go and get yourself a greedy title um, you're not an I am you're a greed you're a greed man now his rook is looking like it should be should be munched um, I've still got my friend Derek Derek, you wouldn't know how much I want to win this game. I will sell my firstborn to win this game. I don't have any, so it's okay. Uh, right, so he's got to go rook here, surely. Do I have a good move after rook here? I can go queen here and then try to get my bishop in there. Let's go for that one. Change, change the diagonals. If I get my bishop to e3, Derek, he's allowing it in. You're such a kind man. Go, Derek. Go, go, go. Derek, be good. Come on. So here comes Derek, and now he's going to get his horrible, horrible, nasty Danny Wrench tricks in. And he's already terrifying me of his Danny Wrench tricks. And he's coming for me. No, Danny. You are. You're a scary man. Okay, do I have tactic take here? Check. Oh, my words. I'm thinking of some blooming genius moves here. Oh, that is, that's such a tricky little move he's got. I, I'm going to go here for now. Oh, okay, no more talking. Concentrate. Fuck it. No, Rook E4! Rook E4! Ah! Ah! Rook E4 was what I played! Rookie four. And now I've been okay. Rookie four. Check. Mouse. Fuck it. Bolex, 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 Bolex. I had him in every game, every single game. Next time, I'm not going to be rushed when I play these. Bloody having someone saying, it's a show in one minute, get your stuff in order. No, I don't care. Ah, oh, look at all these messages I've got saying the show's ready. Okay, okay. <laughs> Ah, oh, that was ah oh, ah oh, right. Well, I better go, and I've got a lovely show now. It's going to be great fun. Can't wait. It's going to be a ball a minute because I'm going to be such a good move. Good move, mood. Okay, I better go. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed that more than me. I want to ah ah ah.